AI is short for artificial intelligence. It's basically computers learning to think like us. Sounds cool, right? Like having a robot butler who can do your taxes. And AI can do amazing things like helping doctors diagnose diseases faster or making cars safer. But hold on, just like any powerful tool, AI can be used for good or bad. Think of it like a hammer. You can build a house with it or you can hit someone over the head. Not great. The problem is AI isn't perfect. It can make mistakes and those mistakes can have real world consequences. That's why there's a big debate right now about AI ethics. Basically, how do we make sure AI is used for good and not for evil? This isn't just some sci-fi movie problem, this is happening right now. So, let's break down the big ethical dilemmas we're facing with AI. Buckle up folks, it's about to get real. One of the biggest worries about AI is bias. Just like people, AI can be prejudiced. How? Well, AI learns from data, and if that data is biased, the AI will be biased too. Imagine you're teaching an AI to be a recruiter. You feed it a bunch of resumes from the past, but those resumes are mostly from men, because historically men held more of those jobs. Guess what? The AI might learn that men are better suited for the job, even if that's not true. This isn't just a hypothetical. There have been real cases of AI systems being racist and sexist. For example, some facial recognition systems are worse at identifying people of color, and some loan approval algorithms discriminate against women. This is a big problem. AI is being used to make important decisions about people's lives, like who gets hired, who gets a loan, and even who gets released from prison. If AI is biased, it can reinforce existing inequalities and make the world a less fair place. Another big concern about AI is its potential to automate jobs. Basically, robots taking over tasks that humans currently do. Now, automation isn't new. We've been using machines to make work easier for centuries, but AI takes things to a whole new level. Think about self-driving trucks, for example. They could put millions of truck drivers out of work, or AI-powered customer service bots. They could replace human representatives in call centers. Now, some argue that AI will create new jobs, and that's true, it probably will. But those new jobs might require different skills, and not everyone will be able to make the transition. This could lead to greater economic inequality, with a small group of people benefiting from AI while others